Hello my beautiful butterflies, and in today's video, I'm going to be playing episode 1 of the Not So Berry Challenge. I found this challenge after watching many other YouTubers do it on their channels. I was so inspired to do it that I decided why not try it out, and here we are. So, the first generation in this challenge is Mint. This challenge was also created by Little Simsy and Always Simming, which is right here, and I will link her Tumblr in the description where you can find this challenge. And then, so generation one is Mint. You are a, mischiev you are a mischievous scientist that really loves the color Mint. You're career driven, but still make time for silly pranks and outings with your closest friends. You love luxury and you want the best for yourself and your family. Traits I will be giving my sim for this challenge is vegetarian, jealous, and materialistic. And the aspiration I'll be giving my sim is chief of mischief, and the career is scientist. And the rules for this legacy or generation is master the scientist career and complete chief of mischief aspiration, master mischief and logic skills, and complete the elements collection, which I know is gonna be so hard because I watched so many other YouTubers do this challenge and completing the elements collection is one of the hardest parts. So yeah, let's get straight into it. I'll be starting off my challenge with, her name is Mint Berry, if it'll pop up, yep, yeah, right there. Mint Berry, she is a young adult and I decided that she should live in Evergreen Harbor because it's a very, I don't know, it just for some reason gave me a mint vibe and she is right next to a little cute I guess you could call it an inn. Let does it lead to the ocean? I have no clue. Um, I'll just call it a river. And she's in this cute little neighborhood and she is living in this starter home townhouse that I picked out of all the starter homes in this area. So yeah, let's get straight into it. So she is currently standing outside of her house, which is pretty basic. I think I should first get her started on her job since that is going to be a very important part of this challenge. So find a job. Oh, that's so cute. Some butterflies. And so she is also going to be mischievous, which I have given her that aspiration. And I've already given her all the traits she will need for this challenge. So she is currently looking on her phone to find a job. And yeah, so. I will need to pick the scientist career, which I haven't ever tried before and I'm excited to try it out. It is $24 an hour, 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. I don't really like those hours, but you get what you get. And then she works on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. So we are now part of that career and her promotion task before she goes to work is have two breakthroughs. And to have breakthroughs, um, I'm pretty sure you can just be doing anything. I am correct. I do not fully know. I have, as I said, never tried this career out. And so yeah, she'll probably just have, um, oops. She'll probably just have her first kind of breakthrough. Possibly, I've seen other sins do it in the shower, but we'll see. It is currently 8.50 a.m and there isn't really anything else to do right now so maybe we could go out into the town and stir up some mischief and so i've taken her to the local bar where she lives and currently there is jeffrey landgrab and that is a sim i wouldn't mind um picking a little bit of a mischievous axe with or picking up a argument i don't know um but let's just start off with a friendly introduction and yeah let's so she is standing over on the other side standing over on the other side of the why are you in pain bruised and bandaged when did you hurt your arm okay so they just had their introduction and mischief Okay, so we want to get started on this first part of her, I guess you could say, aspiration in a way. Oh, she has to be disliked by two sims. So, 
I guess we're gonna be disliked by him. So start a, I have no idea what that word is, but start a rumor. Um, more mischief. I guess I could lie about my career. So, Mint Berry just reached level two of the mischief skill already, which is so crazy because she just started it and currently he is not really liking us right now. He's either a friend or a foe. But we just completed the task of performing 10 mean or mischievous interactions. He currently doesn't dislike us. And I don't know exactly how to make him dislike me. Um, I could claim to be a criminal mastermind. I could scare him. Um, I guess I could... Inst oh, that's mean, but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna instill him with some fake confidence. And her first day of work is in 23 hours, which I'm kind of excited for. Um, but I need to get her to have some breakthroughs. So we should probably get home soon and start i guess try and get some breakthroughs in the sims 4 which is not the easiest thing to do and i should probably also buy the elements board so i can start doing some of those and yeah so we have arrived back home it is currently 1 around 40 pm on sunday the day right before our work starts so i think I should give her the elements boards. Quickly go into, I'm pretty sure they would be on the, not, I don't know about the hobbies and skills, maybe right here, okay. So I think this gray one is cute. So let's just put it in her living area, I guess. It's a little bit of a weird spot to put it. Um, but yeah, I think I also, while I'm in build mode, I'm going to give her house a little bit of a makeover real quick because it's not very mint-esque I would have to say and I think we have enough money to give her a little bit of a makeover I guess I'll probably just leave the kitchen and the bathroom the same but maybe update the living area because it is a little bit sad in its current state so let me really quick delete all the lights there we go. And okay, so let's add in some, oh, those are table lamps, but let's add in some cuter lights because the lights um, Mint currently has are a little bit dark and dark lights in The Sims just are not my forte, I would have to say. <laughs> I'm so weird. Um, and then, so let me just add a couple lights wherever because it doesn't really matter. I'm not going for the best of looks right now. I'll work on it as the challenge continues to go on. And maybe I could also add in some new flooring because the ones right now are a little bit, I don't know, dark and I tend to like lighter flooring in Sims houses. So maybe something like, yeah, that's cute. Okay. So this flooring I will add all throughout the house except for the bathroom because that would be kind of gross and I'm starting to run out of money so I probably shouldn't I guess add in decor I really want to because I just love adding a lot of decor and clutter items into my sims house but I don't think that would be the best decision for how much money we currently have so maybe I should just add in like a rug and then leave it at that I just don't know I don't even know if I should add in a rug. I probably shouldn't. I'll just add in this one for now. And that's what the bedroom looks like. It's very, I guess you could say, plain because I didn't really have a lot of wiggle room. Um, so yeah, let's go downstairs into the living area. I really, really wanted to add in that brick fireplace, but I do not have enough money for it. And then let's just find her a cute and simple cheap couch i guess you could say because as i said we do not have a lot of money right now so a cheap couch is probably one of the better options instead of buying a super expensive one and having to deal with the um i guess decision that i made so that house that oops that couch is pretty cute that one's also very just i guess you could say chic looking so i might add in this couch with a little, I guess you could say, table. Oh, but that coffee, okay. 
I'm probably making a lot of bad decisions right now, but that is just too cute to pass up. And let me sell that, and let me just see if there's anything better that's cheaper. Oh, that's cute. Okay. Oh, but let's knit back into live mode and see how our sim is doing. So she needs to have two breakthroughs, and I do not exactly know how to get her breakthrough. I think it just happens without you even needing to do anything. It can happen at almost any time when the scientist is in a contemplative state, for example, gardening, reading, or performing experiments. So maybe I should quickly see if I have enough money to quickly buy a bookcase, and hopefully I do, because as- oh yes, okay, so this one- I wish I could buy that one. But this one will do with these books, and I'll just set it right there, and then try to get her point farmer no to downfall of blah blah blah. Orbital pudding. Okay, I love pudding, so let's quickly get her to read that. Do you not like being mean or- oh, angry, aggravating conversation. I understand that. Jeffrey is aggravating, Arso the lamb grabs. So let's just let her sit on the couch and then read her book, and, and hopefully she'll have a breakthrough. Well, okay, she had her first breakthrough and wrote down an idea for a momentum conserver. Okay, so that's good. You have your first breakthrough now, and she can go put her book up, and then I'm probably going to have her reading until she goes back to sleep. Wait, can she? Did that just say she can admire the admire new possession? Okay, we all just love admiring the toilets we are about to use because that is in no way at all disgusting uh, i'm gonna have her probably perform another breakthrough um before she goes to bed because that would be so nice and we already completed one part of that from bullying jeffrey landgrab into running out of the i guess you could say bar i feel a little bit bad um like i want you guys to like mint but Right now, she's doing like a lot of unlikable things. Oh, do you want to read again? Oh, and you are a little bit hungry. So I guess you could quickly get dinner and then read. And what is something that you could make that is green to fit your part of the challenge? And since you're a vegetarian, okay, a garden salad, I guess, single serving, because you are currently single, which is okay. It's just, I probably, oh, maybe we could help you find someone at work to marry. I wonder what options we're going to have. Okay, so I guess I could try meeting someone at work because then we could have two scientists in the family. And so, oh my gosh, what just happened with your eyes right there? I'm not very good with that. I guess shift or, yeah, shift camera mode or tab camera mode. I'm not very good at it. And she has acquired the cooking skill. Um, so if, oh, is that Makoa? Oh, why did you just, he just came in. I need to lock my door. He just came into the house. Oh. She just picked her ear and put it back in the food. That's gross. Um, so, Makoa, since you have come inside, I might as well just meet you with a- Oh, my- Is that brown? Okay, so she made a poor quality salad, and I'm going to quickly bully him since he did just break into my lovely abode. Oh, I just realized we should be reading, so I guess I'm gonna do one last mischievous interaction, and then I will- Oh, claim to be a criminal mastermind. So we are going to read, and then what would be a good book for her to read? Um, she did want to read The Untamed Treachery of the Heart, and I wouldn't mind if she was like a reader sim as well, she liked to read. Um, is she even eating or is she just arguing? So I'm going to quickly just cancel out those interactions. And he just left out of anger. Okay, she's not getting the best reputation. But that is okay, and she needs to be disliked by two sims, and currently, the only two sims she knows do not- Oh, she, she knows someone named Victor, but currently, Mako and Jeffrey do not like her. So, maybe we should fix all the relationships we ruin um, at the end of her- I guess you could say- Oh! She's having- she's about to have another breakthrough. Okay, so let's go read, and maybe we- Oh, are you putting your book away? Why'd you just slip and fall? No, I don't want you to chat with him. Okay, I'm quickly going to lock the door for everyone but Min, because that is so annoying. Um, but read, just, okay, read your book. It's so annoying when sins do not do what you want them to do, so let's just have you read your book and relax. So she had her second breakthrough and wrote down an idea for a synthetic food serum, 
and so currently she has had two breakthroughs so there is a small chance that she could get a promotion at work tomorrow oh akira listen are you oh my gosh I was going to say Akira could be a good love interest, but he just said, listen, are you always as stupid or are you making a special effort today? And I'll just say, yes, I am. So I, okay, I have another sim that I can start an argument with. I will probably leave Jeffrey alone because Makoa and Akira have, I guess, angered me. I don't know. She's very angry right now. She's no win scenario and aggravating conversation. She fell down bad yep that food did not look good but at least you have a focused eureka quickly get you upstairs because it is 8 15 and you probably are a little bit tired yeah she's pretty low in energy but i'm glad that we got two eureka moments today and we already started on our mischief we haven't started on our logic yet but that can be something we can do later in the challenge maybe while she's an adult she can pick up chess. And I just realized Makoa, when he went outside, he went outside to kick over our trash can. So, oh, and you are stinky and you need to use the restroom. So quickly go use the toilet. Oh, I think we should start thinking about her education. She actually has not had any education so far because she is our first gen. So she will not be attending college. She has other things to do. So she has work in eight hours, and I don't think it would be very good if you went into work stinky. So just take a shower after that, and maybe just pick up the trash in the trash can that are outside, because that is very annoying. Thank you, Makoa. And then let's throw away all of this trash. We're not going to rummage through the trash. And I should probably uninstall those, like, not feel- Oh my gosh, Slice of Life is already making her sick. Okay, we should probably, I guess, I have another medical mod that can make Sims sick, so she might want to, I guess, and it is freezing outside, and she is in her regular outfit, which is just a jean skirt and a short sleeve shirt, so she should probably get on a cozy sweater, and we do not have a fireplace, so I don't know what else to do. So her work is in six more hours, and she is actually going to go pick up a book so that's nice she does have to become more mischievous so we only have 19 dollars in the entire world but it might be smart to buy a book that teaches your sim about mischievous or logic i don't know yes okay so let's buy a mis oh we do not have enough money to buy a mischief book that stinks so i don't know if anyone would be awake but let's see if akira can come over and maybe we could have a conversation oh no her acne is really bad how much would it cost to get some i guess face masks skincare buy a sheet mask a one-time treatment okay so she can wear one of those before work and did it say he was sleeping akira is sleeping is there anyone oh you're hungry what are you gonna get i don't like when it just says cook i wish it would say cook what she is going to cook so i will have mint go cook herself Maybe, what would be a good breakfast that is vegetarian? Oh yeah, vegetarian. I was thinking vegan for a second, like vegans can't eat eggs, but you can make yourself some eggs and toast for breakfast. So let's have you cook up a storm and make yourself some eggs and toast before you go to work, which is in five more hours, which feels so long, but time goes by so quickly in this game. So you can have yourself eat your breakfast with your face mask on, and then you can go to work and maybe we could meet a boyfriend or future spouse. So let's have you clean up that dish and work is in four more hours. I'm just seeing like I'm counting down the time, but is there anything else we could do around in the neighborhood? Oh, I wonder if anyone would be awake. Maybe I should try calling Makoa. Oops, Sentex. No, 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 no. Okay. Um, so I can't invite him invite to hang out in current lot that means makoa is somewhere nearby uh that's a little bit mysterious but we are currently calling akira so we can start a little bit of an argument with him since okay so let's just go over to akira and start a rude introduction with him even though we've already kind of been introduced over the phone then just she doesn't look like a mean sim and she just walked outside in her pajamas and then mischief maybe 
invite to fake party just let's perform some mischievous actions before we go to work because why not they just un autonomously got into a fight and oh my gosh i downloaded this mall called slice of life and she now has a black eye a bruised lip and a cut on her cheek okay so that did not go very well so let's just continue i guess being mischievous instead of being mean because clearly are we disliked by him yet oh not yet is he leaving please don't leave yet i need to be mean to you some more okay so we are disliked by makoa which is i guess you could say nice right here be disliked by two sims one out of two already completed so yeah okay so work for mint starts in one hour so we should probably um get you inside i don't know what i should do so you can just go read we should probably get you dressed for work but i think you'll just auto automatically dress her once she goes so let's just pass the time by oh my gosh okay so it's about to be her work but she just started and they just oh she just beat up akira oh my gosh she just came inside and then they started fighting okay so trusty notepad in hand it's time for mint to go to work okay finally i've been waiting this for this for so long maybe today is a day for a major breakthrough care to join them or should they go to work alone i will join her because she needs to kind of get through this career with an a plus um so i think i'm going to help direct her in that direction that didn't make a lot of sense okay so she is now at work and ask a co-worker for a crystal brainstorm on invention constructor invent the momentum conserver so there is a receptionist who is an older and we have a lot of co oh is nox a co-worker no that's not nox oops um labs oh my gosh okay nox is a co-worker and he actually could possibly be a good option to romance i do not know so let's um friendly introduce ourselves to Kalidus. so friendly introduction oops i just paused and then or oh co ask for a crystal okay and then let's introduce ourselves to nox well oh we already are introduced okay so okay sure i gave some extra crystals lying around here you go we have one simonite chat with cletus harris so just talk with him ask oops i didn't mean to go by that quickly ask a co-worker for metal why not we're already introduced ourselves to cletus let's just ask him for some metal and then oh who is this are there any females that are work that we can befriend or is it just males wait there's another room over here well, that's not here is Nalani to know a co-worker okay so friendly introduction let's go over here and get to know Nalani if she can walk any quicker possibly oh is that another female co-worker Mary Green get to know okay let's well, really quick friendly only introduction let's go over to Nalani instead of talking with Cletus and then so we just had our friendly introduction and let's get to know nalani brainstorm okay so chat and then i think that's a social one and then this one is actual doing things and just preparing maybe so brainstorm which we are currently doing right yeah brainstorm and then chat with robot afterwards is this going to actually pop up or no oh there it goes okay so you are continuing to brainstorm we have already done that so invent device momentum conserver on our first day we are already inventing a device the day is almost over oh no only three only four more hours did it just glitch out oh no there we go did we do it i think it just keeps on freezing okay let's see invented okay we did it okay good job so turn on so let's move th where do we how do we turn it on um turn on okay we already got an entire bar for today and you need to use a restroom and i'm pretty sure they are upstairs so let's go use the restroom upstairs real quick feel like a champion okay um so we did a lot of work today and we introduced ourselves to some people um instead of actually fighting them and i think neilani is good friendship material 
And then, oh, she already has sentiments with the both of them. That's nice. And where is Knox? Because I'm sort of into the idea that Knox could be the person who we romance. Or maybe Cletus? I do not know. Tell me what you guys think down below. Because I think I might end the video soon. Because we have accomplished a lot, in my opinion, already. So yeah, after we go home from work today and get into bed, I think I'll end the video there. And I hope you guys will enjoy. So we only have about two hours left of work today. We've already accomplished a lot of stuff. So let's maybe go introduce ourselves. Well, kind of not introduce, but just talk around. Oh wait, we haven't. Okay. So let's go to Knox and introduce ourselves, because he isn't the worst into romance, I think. We can talk about history, because why not do that as a scientist? That just makes sense. And I'll just continue to build up that friendship bar with him. So the work day is almost over, just a couple more minutes, and there we go, it is over. And oh, we have already been promoted. Min has been promoted to Apprentice Inventor. She will now make an additional $8 per hour for a grand total of $32 per hour. She also has received the following bonus, $192, new clothes, Journey to the Stars. And her next shift is Tuesday at 10 a.m. and it is Monday. And she has earned $281 today, which is a pretty good feat, I would have to say. So Min is now done with work, and I think I'm going to end the video here. I think on a good note as well, since we have now been promoted, we have met a future love interest in a new friend. Tell me what you guys think in the, in the comments, if you think Knox could be a good person we could romance, and if Neilani could be a good friend. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Have a lovely, beautiful day or night, wherever you are, and see you guys later.